All right, drones first got popular as a fun device to use as a hobby, but over the years, they've started being developed for different purposes. As our McKenna Alexander explains for us this morning, one of those ways is helping police officers catch and arrest potentially dangerous suspects. She joins us now in studio to talk about it. Hey there, McKenna. Yeah, hey, you guys. The Madison Police Department is among the first responders that are now using drone technology to help officers in the field. The drone's ability to track and locate from above provides officers with a safe way of monitoring suspects and keeping both them and officers safe. MPD Captain Mike Hansen says using the drone has revolutionized officers' toolkits when in dangerous situations. This is a complete game changer because we can locate suspects as in this video from a distance away. We can find their heat signature. We can keep them safe. The suspect Hansen is referring to is a 39-year-old Trokong Kringa. On Thursday, police, police were called to Fitchburg where a cab driver said he'd just been robbed by a passenger who stole personal belongings and an iPad. After tracking that iPad to a nearby wooded area, police released a drone to find Kringa. When officers approached him, he, he lit a bush on fire and ran from police. A short time later, he was arrested and booked into the Dane County Jail, where he's facing charges of armed robbery, neg negligent handling of burning material, and resisting an officer. We have more on that incident and how officers are using drone footage up on channel3000.com.